When we hear of the growing crisis in soil fertility and food security, it's easy to feel powerless, to feel there is no hope. But what if there was something we could do? One farmer at a time, one field, one village, one district at a time. Meet Clementine Murekatete. She lives in eastern Rwanda, and like many subsistence farmers in the region, Clementine was struggling to feed her family for years. Soil degradation meant her maize harvest was getting smaller every year. Clementine tried using chemical fertilizers, but ran out of money. With no fertilizer, her yields dropped even further. She was in a desperate situation. Her typical harvest was 50 kilograms of maize, many of the cobs too small to eat. Her family was hungry. No surplus crops to sell meant no money. Her children stopped going to school. She simply couldn't afford the fees. But everything changed for Clementine. Today, her maize crop is growing like never before. She harvests up to 2,000 kilograms of maize every year. She has diversified too. She grows vegetables and keeps chickens. Every year, she sells her surplus crops at the local market. The money has transformed life for Clementine and her family. So what changed for Clementine? In 2020, she was one of a group of farmers trained by LifeWorks. She learned how to make organic fertilizers from local materials like milk, rice, fish and molasses. She also learned how to make compost from grass, leaves and cow dung. These fertilizers are rich in microbes that restore soil fertility and improve the health of crops. They can be made very cheaply. The microbes in these fertilizers do amazing things. They make nutrients in the soil available in a form that plants can absorb more easily. They create soil conditions that fight pests and diseases. They improve the structure of the soil that helps the plants build stronger root systems. This means the soil retains water and plants can survive periods of little rain, as well as times when there's too much rain. Healthy soil helps farmers withstand the weather extremes that are increasingly common as the climate changes. And well-structured soil is also better at storing carbon. We believe regenerating the world's soils is key to addressing the climate emergency. Our training has already changed the lives of farmers in 10 countries, mostly in sub-Saharan Africa. In each country, we train groups of trainers, people with farming knowledge who are well-placed to train as many farmers as possible. These include lead farmers, government agronomists, and program officers with NGOs that support farming communities. Our training is offered free of charge to participants, and we equip those we train to share what they learn with others. On average, those who attended training go on to train about a hundred farmers. Some have even trained close to a thousand. Clementine has become one of those lead farmers passing on the LifeWorks training. Now, more than ever, we need to restore and protect our soils. LifeWorks training does exactly that, starting with one farmer, one field, one village, one district at a time. And with your help, we can do more.
To find out more about LifeWorks and to watch videos that show you how to prepare four different microbial inputs, please visit our website. Thank you.